Hi there, we just have a couple letters left of our ABC Bible devotion time, popcorn clouds and bubblegum trees. I hope you've learned about God as we've gone through the ABCs, and I hope that you learn that we can look at anything and see God's hand in it. So let's get started with Y. Y is for yes. What would you like for breakfast? Yolanda asked her little brother, Raymond. Toast? No, said Raymond. How about cereal? asked Yolanda. No, said Raymond. Juice? No. Mama, complained Yolanda. Raymond is impossible. All he says is no, no, no. Raymond's not impossible, soothed the mother. He's just two. Two-year-olds are like that. You were worse, Yolanda, said Louis, Yolanda's big brother. You were the terriblest two-year-old ever I knew. Yolanda stuck her tongue out at Louis. I know how to make Ramon say yes, she said. From the refrigerator, she got ice cream, and from the cupboard, she got cones. She scooped ice cream into a cone and carried it over to Ro Raymond's high chair. Raymond, she asked with a smile, would you like some ice cream? No, said Raymond, pushing the cone away angrily. It tumbled from Yolanda's hand and onto the floor. Yolanda reached down and put the cone on the high chair tray. I was thinking, Papa said quietly. Raymond says, no, no, no. But God says, yes, yes, yes. It's quite the opposite. What do you mean, Papa? asked Yolanda. God is so patient. Even when we sin, he just keeps loving us and helping us. He keeps saying yes to us, like the time he sent a big fish to rescue naughty Jonah from the sea. I know, said Yolanda. God said yes to Noah and the animals when he saved them from the flood. God said yes to David when he fought the giant, added Mama. How about the time God made a path for the Israelites right through the Red Sea, said Louis. That was a pretty big yes. It was, said Papa, but the biggest yes of all was when God sent Jesus. I think when Jesus comes back to get rid of Satan and be king forever, that will be an even bigger yes, said Mama. When Jesus comes back, I think all the angels of heaven will shout, yes, yes, yes. For a moment, everyone was quiet. There was a lot to think about. Then Yolanda noticed Raymond, covered with ice cream and grinning from ear to ear. She went over to him and put her hand on his head. Does God love Raymond? She asked, smiling. Yes, shouted Raymond. Yes, agreed Yolanda, laughing and giving Raymond a big hug. God loves Raymond, and so do I. Well, that's a pretty awesome story about the letter Y and yes. I guess I've never thought about it that way. That's so cool to have um, some devotion time with somebody that helps us understand things we see every day in a whole new way. I love that. So it's praise time, Psalm 105, verse two. Sing to the Lord, sing praises to him. Tell about all the wonderful things he has done. So you could turn to somebody when we're done and tell them the wonderful things that God's done for you. I would love for you to comment below this so that I can hear what you think God has done so wonderfully in your life. Let's say Psalm 105 verse 2 again. Sing to the Lord. Sing praises to him. Tell about the wonderful things he has done. God doesn't want us to keep that to ourselves. He wants us to tell our family and friends how wonderful he is and the wonderful things he's done for us. Let's pray. God, you say yes to us in so many ways, ways that I don't always think about. Help us to recognize the yeses that you put in our life and help us to not be afraid to tell our family and friends what a great big God you are. Help us to say yes to you. In Jesus' name, amen. Well, I love you guys, and God loves you so much more. Bye for now.